Well, guys, we're on here at Atlas Survival Shelters. You know what I got here? This is a relic from World War II. Now, this is a Morrison shelter. These were created during World War II for people who lived in high-rise apartments that when the Germans were bombing, they could actually, instead of go down into a bunker that they didn't have, they could crawl under a table. So this was a specially made table that you would put in the apartment. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you how it works. You remove the screen right here because this catches the debris as it falls off. You climb into the Morrison shelter like this, okay? And you'll get better at it. And then basically you just hang it back up. And this is designed to catch the debris as it is coming off. And you crawl in here and you just basically sleep, you know? You spend the night because the Russians are trying to bomb you, so you have some protection. This will catch the major concrete coming off from the walls. This will catch debris coming down on top of you. And you have a degree of protection. So if some of you are laughing, don't laugh, because this thing right here saved thousands of lives during World War II. So there's three shelters I've come out with just to help Ukraine. The Morrison Shelter, the Anderson Shelter, and also the little Atlas safe room with the sliding door. So there's three products I created just to help the civilians of Ukraine while they're in this nasty war with Russia. So to get out of here, I'm just gonna kind of like pull myself with this mesh there. So like I said, this all bolts together. This will ship as a kit. All right, looking at it from the inside, you can see all the nuts and bolts in here. and how it bolts together. I went ahead and signed the very first one to memorize this date, Ron Hubbard, Atlas, 10-13-2022. So let me show you how thick this is. See this plate right here? That is 3 eighths plate on the corners. You know, that is uh, pretty damn heavy, but we found the old documents on these, so we literally built these to the specifications that existed in, in the 1940s when they were building this. And uh, so it's pretty heavy. Um, but we powder coated it and for now, we're just gonna have them in black. And then we're gonna work on making some kind of a bedspread cover. So when they put them in the apartments, this will be their dinner table. And uh, you won't see all the mess and stuff, but you uh, pull off the dinner cover and uh, or the table cover and you'll have yourself your shelter. So it just occurred to me another use you could use for this cage in case you're in America and you're seeing this. You know, there is this thing called BDSM, which are just pretty much kinky people that like to lock people up. That's the original Morrison shelter reproduced right here at my factory in Poland for Ukraine. So I hope you guys like it. And uh, I hope it doesn't have to get used too much, but unfortunately, I think Russia is going to open up another line of attack. And this is the answer for all those high-rise buildings I saw in Ukraine that gives those people that are going to stay in those apartments a place to protect their families during the bombings.